we are going to look at geometry problems. And geometry problems are problems related to circles, rectangles, triangles, and other geometric shapes. And we need to use what we know about these shapes to solve the problem. So we're going to look at a couple of these to start with. The first one we're going to look at is a perimeter of a rectangular pool, which is 180 feet. So we recognize immediately we've got a perimeter of a rectangle, and it's 180 feet. So we know the formula for perimeter is 2L plus 2W. We're also told that the length of the pool, the L, is, so there's our equal sign, to be 10 feet more than the width. So more than means plus, there's our W. And so we get another equation that says L equals 10 feet more than, the then means reverse order, so the 10 comes second, and the W comes first. Now because it's a plus, that doesn't matter as much, but if this had been a minus, if this had been 10 less feet than the width, we'd have to make sure we put the W first. Well, notice that this equation has a P, an L, and a W. Well, we were told that our P is 180 feet. So I can replace the P with 180. That's now equal to 2L, but we don't want to use L. We want to use W plus 10 plus 2W. So now that we've done, we found the, our formula, notice that we only have w's left over. That's our only unknown. So we can, at this point, continue to work the problem. We can distribute 2w plus 20 plus 2w. So 180 equals 4w plus 20 when we combine like terms. We'll subtract 20 from both sides. We'll get 160 equals 4w. Divide by 4. Reverse side, so the W is on the left instead of the right. 160 divided by 4 is 40. So we know that our width is 40. Well, our length is our width plus 10, so our length is 50. So it's 10 more than the width, and we have a 50 by 40 or 40 by 50 dimensions on our rectangular pool. If we wanted to make sure we were right, we can go back to our original and say, is 180 equal to 2 times 40 plus 2 times 50? Notice I did the W first instead of the L. That's it's addition. That'll work out. So is 180 equal to 80 plus 100? And sure enough, 180 equals 180. So it checks out, and we have our answer.